Today, I'm going to show you how to export a video using Premiere Pro. I have this project that I've edited, and it's ready to be exported out to Movie. The steps I'm going to show you will let you create a high-quality movie that you could upload to YouTube. So to export a movie, we go to File, Export Media, and we have this panel that shows us the export settings for creating a video. The best setting for uploading to YouTube is to change this to H.264, and that's the format that we should use. H.265 is not supported by YouTube, and H.264 is a good format for quality. Now we're going to do a preset, and we're going to match the source so that we have hybrid rate. Match source means that the, the output size will match the source size. We can see that we have our source video is 1920 by 1080 pixels, and our output is the same size. We'll change the output name. And we can set that to whatever um, file name we want. So I'm just going to call this test01. Um, and we're outputting both audio and video. And now the other important setting is the bitrate. The bitrate refers to the quality similar, similar to a JPEG setting. For 1080p, a good setting is a bitrate of 10 Mbps. Here are the settings that are recommended for YouTube videos to get good quality uploads. We see that 1080p refers to the vertical resolution. And at 1080p, if our frame rate is 24 to 30, then we want to use 8 megabits per second. If we have a higher frame rate video, then we use the higher Mbps. Since I'm doing a 1080p video, I'm going to do uh, 8 and add a little bit of a buffer, so I'm going to use 10 Mbps. If I was doing a 4K video, so you see that the vertical resolution is 2160, then I would need a much higher bit rate, and I would set the bit rate to whatever I needed for the size of video that I have. If you're creating a small format video, like you might be doing for a student project, then you might have 720p, and you want to set that to 5 megabits per second. Once you've set the bit rate, it will tell you the estimated file size for the length of your movie. So here I have a 5 minute movie, and my estimated file size is 377 megabytes. The only other setting to check here might be audio. And for audio, we want to set this to usually the highest quality settings. So we set this as high, and we can set the bit rate to the highest whisper bit rate. I'm going to enable maximum quality rendering, and now I'm basically ready to go. I'm going to click the export button, and it should start compiling a video. This could take anywhere from a few minutes to um, several minutes. Once that's done, the window will close, and I'm back to editing. Now I'd like to find my video and see how it came out. If you're not sure, the location is printed in the um, edit or export settings. So I'm going to go to completed videos, completed videos, and here's test 01 that I created. And if I double click on it, then I should see my video play. If the video looks good, now you're ready to upload this to YouTube. That's it for how we create a video in Premiere Pro.